This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and today we are going to talk about disc padlocks. Now, a couple of weeks ago, I featured this lock, the Abus Discus Model 2690 on this channel. That was video number 447. It is the largest and heaviest disc padlock in my collection, and I received the predictable question in the comments, and that is, what is the smallest disc padlock in your collection? So today we are going to talk about the various sizes that these disc padlocks come in. There is of course this 90 millimeter lock and there's a few companies that make disc padlocks this large, though they are relatively uncommon. Also relatively uncommon are the 80 millimeter locks. And here I have an Abus model 2080, but there are a few companies including Master Lock that have 80 millimeter disc padlocks. By far the most common size for disc padlocks is 70 millimeter vert locks. And here we have one, this is the Abus Discus 2570. And I probably have at least 30 different models of 70 millimeter disc padlocks in my collection. So clearly everyone and their brother is making one of these. Then we get down to less common sizes again at 60 millimeters, I have this Brinks lock. It's relatively small and it actually has a particular application that I'll show you in a future video. And finally, we get down to the smallest disc padlock in my collection, and that is this 50 millimeter generic Chinese lock. So we're gonna see what it takes to pick into this little 50 millimeter disc padlock. It actually presents some issues because it's so small. It's a little bit hard to hold and pick at the same time. It has a four pin, standard pin core, and we're going to pick it open using this tension wrench from the Peterson Flat 5 and an 18,000 standard hook. Okay, number one is loose. Click out of two. Three is loose. Click out of four. Back to the beginning. Click out of one. Two is loose, three is binding, and that's all it took to open up. So clearly not a difficult lock to pick, but a novelty of a disc padlock only because it is so small. I'm not even sure what we would use this on. So that's all I have for you today. If you have any questions or comments, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.